there everyone, it's me, Team Robbie, back with another video. This time, I am going to discuss the upcoming Blu-ray set and DVD set. It's going to come out sometime in 2012, late 2012 and early 2013. So brace yourself, sit back, get something to drink. It's going to be an awesome video. I guarantee it. Here we go. Some of the titles such as Goldberg, Goldberg, War Games, and the Triple H documentary has been discussed in the past and some has even made it to the scheduling before. However, it looked like the 2013 may finally see their release. It also appears that the 2013 may be the year of Volume 2 with the second edition of the ECW, ECW, ECW unreleased and the best of Money Nitro. Also, if you look towards the end of the year, W looking to bring out the big guns in time for the holiday season with the history of the WWE and Raw 20th anniversary box set. What do you think about that? News wrestling fans. I'm looking forward to that. Okay let me continue here. Here is the completely list of the pay-per-views, documentaries and all that great stuff. So let me continue once again. The WWE TLC pay-per-view will be released January 15th. The best of Raw and SmackDown 2012 will be released January 29th. The best of Nitro Volume 2 on February 12th. That'd be awesome. I have number um, one, so this will be on Blu-ray, hopefully. Um, the, the Royal Rumble 2013, it will be released February 26th, hopefully on Blu-ray in the United States. It all depends how W works. Alright, another cool thing. Brett the Human Heart, the Hall of Famer, unreleased matches March 5th, the Elimination Chamber 2013, it all depends. Uh, if it's going to be good and bonus stuff, hopefully on Blu-ray, but I freaking doubt it. Um, March 19th, Mick Foley, biography. Um, damn, that's going to be freaking awesome. April 16th, oh man, this is going to be another great one to pick up. The best of In Your House. April 30th, everyone looking forward to that one. Everyone want that one, big time. WrestleMania 29. May 14th, we all know that, definitely it's going to be on Blu-ray, and another one I definitely want to pick up, the top 25 rivals, May 28th, the Extreme Rules, 2013, it will be released, um, June 18th, it all depends what kind of match you're going to book, Goldberg, wow, June 25th, TBA, pay-per-view would be two would be announced I think they switch in pay-per-views I forgot what one July 16th ECW unreleased volume 2 I discussed that a couple of days ago July 30th Money in the Bank pay-per-view 2013 it will be released August 13th Best of Master Square Garden I like to get that to add to my Russian collection hopefully that's on Blu-ray August 27th the Best of War Games September 10th, SummerSlam 2013, released September 17th, the top 20th uh, Divas Countdown, September 20, 24th, that'd be kind of cool. See the old school uh, Divas, Triple H, the biography, October 8th. Now, about that one, I thought they canceled that a while back. I guess they um, re released it or something like that. That's what I heard on. Um, Twitter or some other website. Maybe that was a fake, fake statement. Okay, here. Um, Night of Champions, 2013, October 15th. Money in the Bank, Anthology, 
October 29th. Now for that one, I uh, may get it, I may not, it all depends. If they're going to have a great documentary, not just all freaking matches, what they did for the Elimination Chamber a while back. But that'd be kind of cool to see that. If they have it on Blu-ray, I'll definitely get it. Okay, Over Limit 2013 will be released on November 5th. Oh yeah, um, they switched pay-per-views, so Over Limit, instead of having it in, a, in the springtime, you're going to put it in the fall time. So that's why they said TB, um, TBD to be announced. That's what I said earlier in this video. I wonder what kind of pay-per-view name is gonna bring back. Maybe Backlash. That'd be kind of awesome. Or a Great American Bash or something like that. Maybe War Games. I like to see that. Okay, let me continue here. Okay, um, history of WWE. Oh, that'd be awesome to get. On November 19th. Oh, that'd be a great Christmas gift. Hell in a Cell 2013 will be released on November 26th. So close to um, Thanksgiving. Probably get it for my birthday or whatever. Oh, this would be another one. Um, the Raw 25th Anniversary Box Set, December 3rd. No, no, definitely is going to be on Blu-ray. Uh, Sarashari 2013. Uh, we really, we're, sorry, will be released December 24th. So close to Christmas. And also, I'll be there live for Indianapolis, Indiana. I'm looking forward to that. I have information on already on tickets. The best of the week pay -per views December 31st so that's awesome now um so how does the 2013 schedule measure up this year and what are your standing out titles for you yeah what ones are you looking forward to pick up all of them or just certain ones I don't know if you're a big time collector myself you might not get all of them but if you just say average uh, collector, you might just want to get the documentaries. So I think the 2013 coming up look like a, a stack uh, Blu-rays coming out and uh, DVDs. This is gonna be a great year for a wrestling fan to add to your uh, Blu-ray collection or DVD collection. Now, um, if you only have um, the uh, the older ones, like um, I said uh, a couple of days ago, like. Um, the foul, the fouls count anywhere match with Mick Foley the host. If you have Netflix, it's on Netflix already. Or the latest, of the ECW Volume One, it's on Netflix. So thank God I had Netflix. I would definitely will get that eventually on Blu-ray because I don't get the bonus stuff. So this is just a short video. Hopefully everyone enjoys that. And take care, Spiky here. And that's about it from your good old buddy here, Team Rai Rai. Goodbye, everyone. And also, this is on, on WWE DB News. That's why I got this information. Thank you very much for the information, DVD News. You guys are rock on. Keep on whatever you guys are making videos. Goodbye. And hit the sub button. Goodbye. Yeah.